you know, when I'm playing the right way and playing well, I, I'm pretty tough to beat. But it's up to me to to be more consistent at that level. And I'm, I know I'm getting I'm getting there. I've, I've always been improving. I still think my best tennis is two years ahead of me, two, three years ahead of me, even though I'm 26 right now. Uh, so it's, uh, you know, I want, I want to be that guy for, you know, for American tennis. I don't want to be content at being number 10 in the world right now. I want to keep on climbing. I want to get to nine. I want to get to eight, seven, six, five. I want to get in that top five eventually. From there, if you're at that point, then anything's possible. I have, I'll have very few opportunities to go back home and uh, kind of get on the practice court. I need to get in better shape. If I want to do any sort of damage at uh, these next two Grand Slams and these big Master Series events coming up, I need to be in better shape. And I need to work on my game. I need to continue to get better. So that's what I'm going to do after this event <coughs> in Florida. I'm going to you know, put my head down, go to work, and uh, you know, get my body right, get in very good shape, and go over to Europe and try to, you know, try to try to play well. Didn't see it coming, but for me, it's not. I don't feel like it's that surprising because with my serve, I, I feel like I can serve uh, or hold serve effectively on any surface, even though if it's slow clay or whatever the surface may be. And a lot of times, clay can it can play fast and it can play quick and the ball and for the most part the ball bounces high and uh, and for me obviously that's really good with the I'm hitting forehands right here shoulder level that's better than hitting them at my, at my knees I'm able to get more of the ball I'm able to put them in the spots where I, where I want to put them and uh, I've always enjoyed playing on clay and I think I think my clay court results in my career haven't been indicative of how good of a player I, I can be on the surface. Do you pay attention? Has the added attention you've gotten uh, recently, uh, is that a distraction or mm -hmm. you handle it well? Or? No, I think I'm handling it well. I think when, when I came out of college and I did very, I did well very early, I had got I had a, a lot of attention, a lot of people expected a lot of things. I mean, I think, and I, although I said it didn't add much pressure on me, I tried, tried not to let it affect me, it did. You know, people were expecting big things from me and, and simply at, at that point, 2007, 2008, I just wasn't ready for it. But now, um, you know, I want people to expect a lot of me. Cause that, I've been on Twitter lately and a lot of people are writing me. You know, cause I, you know, I did well at Davis Cup, our team did well at Davis Cup. And, and so in turn, it kind of reflects pretty well on the University of Georgia with me playing well over there and obviously on a, on a bigger level, Bubba winning the biggest golf tournament in the world. So Go dogs. Go dogs. that's you, right. You couldn't find it on TV over in Monte Carlo either. No kidding. So we're, we're sitting there, our team, after we had won, and we're, everybody's got their computers out. It's in the live leaderboard, it's not as good, but it's, it's something. 